All right, hey right, guys, we will. Remember when I did the panning, right? So I had been waiting for the other stuff to dry. I've uh, not really don't have the right stuff to get it dry with, so I kind of had to let nature and a butane lighter take its place. <laughs> oh well, whatever it takes, right? So if you look, got a little, oh, you can't see there, but there we go, now you can. We did get the uh, gold separated though, right? So, you guys hold on, we'll be right back. We're gonna take care of all of it, and then everybody's gonna know how much gold I got out of that booger. So, hold on, I'll be back. All right, and we're back. I have a scale here from when I was gold panning before. It's kind of got some other gunk on it too and stuff. I kind of use the scale for all kinds of stuff, but it should still work for this. The top is actually, I get it all cleaned up. It's been sitting a while. It's got dust all over it. But, it's not going to matter. I'm going to put a piece of paper in there. I already have it cut right over here. I'm going to set it right inside this tray here. Because the tray is already zeroed out. It will zero out. I'm going to show you the scale actually is on. It's set. It's zero. It's more than that now because I'm holding on to it. But it will zero out when I, I'm going to turn it off and then set this tray on there and then I will turn it back on so it will zero out with the tray if you guys can understand that anybody that does gold mining or weighs other stuff can probably come print day with what I'm trying to say let me get this tripod to working right here it's wanting to bounce stuff around, so here we go. So you can see right here, I have the scale. I'm gonna put it out here where you guys can see it. It's right there. The gold is right here. I'm gonna turn the scale on right now. And it is reading zero, just like it's supposed to. I'm gonna dump this in there and see what we came up with. Come on, all of you. There we go. There was lots of it in there, I thought, for what we had. It was kind of flaky dirt. Yeah, it's empty now. And we have, it says 0 0.6, 0 0.6 of a gram. Well, I'm not getting rich, but it was free. <laughs> I want to thank uh, M&M Prospecting again. Shout out to them. Uh, they have these drawings every once in a while. And make sure that you get over there and uh, see them. While I have this open, I have another vial of gold here. This is work what we got in Washington when we were working up there. My son got this out. I'm going to throw it all in there and see what we our grand total is. Let's see. Here we go. We're going to put it all in there. All right. And that says <laughs> it didn't move it. It should have. Scale must be off a little bit. 
Yeah, we'll do it all over again. I don't care. Take that piece of paper out of there very gently. I kind of bent the corners up so it'd be easy to get a hold of. There we go. Well, I'll, yeah. Like that. Put it all back into the dish. Turn this back off. Put the paper back in the lid so I can get it back out again. That will zero the scale out. Here we go. Turn it back on. All right. So let's see what we got all together here. With my son's gold and the gold I got from M&M. Maybe we all have to start doing golding, panning, whatever they call that. They don't have any here. I'll have to buy pay dirt. But that would be uh, something to do. 0.8, 0 0.9. Come on, all of you. Get out of there. Alright. Looks like we're not going to get rich, but we're going to have some gold. It says we have. It, it went up 0.3. So we have 0.9 grams worth of gold <laughs> that's better than nothing you guys all right so now you have it you have me panning it now you have me weighing it next thing is to buy some more gold more pay dirt and do it again <laughs> till next time you guys thanks for watching appreciate you everything you do for me till next time god bless you god bless me and god bless the usa see ya